Hey guys, so today I have this very cute bear that I bought from uh, Miniso a long while ago and I thought I would turn him into a cute stuffy drawing. I didn't want to do any shapeshifters today, just a stuffy drawing. And I actually have another bear, well it's not really a bear, it's a koala bear and it's in the same look as this one so i did a second video um that will be the next video but for this video i'm just drawing this bear i thought it'd be cute to draw him the concept of this bear is actually the reason why i purchased it was so a while ago actually my birthday is on april 19th and then bakugo's birthday is on april 20th for those of you who don't know bakugo is a favorite character of mine from my hero academia so um i kind of nowadays celebrate with my bakugo pillow and i give him some gifts here and there as well so yeah um for him this was bought like I want to say two years ago and it's really cute and the reason why I purchased it for him was because so the bear actually has um its eyes are embroidered and it has like eyelashes but because the fur is so fuzzy and it covers up like some of the eyelashes it actually looks like it's Angie like angry <laughs> so I bought it because of that um because Bakugo is always angry, so I thought it would be super cute to buy it for him. So yeah, it actually has eyelashes, but it looks more angry because of the f way the fur like sits on the eyes and everything. So yeah, I drew him as angry instead of just drawing in eyelashes. And to be honest, I think he much looks much cuter like this as well. And the bow that he's wearing is actually also from Miniso. It was a cat slash dog collar that you could get. And honestly, this was during a time where I was just buying a bunch of stuff and they had like cat and dog collars and I thought they would be super cute. So I do have some like where I put them on my pillows, like the corner of my pillow and as display. So that way it looks cute with the characters. For Bakugo, he already has like this cat collar from the alley, which is a bubble tea shop. So yeah, that one was more expensive to buy. Honestly, don't know why I ended up buying a bunch of cat and dog collars. I just thought it would be cute accessories to put on my pillows. So yeah, he already has one like that. But this one I bought for him originally and I decided to end up putting it on his bear. Um, so it looks super cute and fancy. I was borderline gonna actually draw this as a shapeshifter, like those characters that I make that are animals that look like people, but I decided not to because I wanted to keep the cuteness. Also, this is what I do when I have like some form of artist block sometimes i can't think of what to draw so the only thing that is a good solution for me is because i collect a lot of plushies i prefer to actually draw them as like either shapeshifters like people or draw them in their original form so yeah, so if you ever have artist block, this is a great way to kind of get rid of that and get you in the zone of drawing like new types of characters. It definitely helps me. I don't know if anyone else does this <laughs> or like let me know in the comment section below like what you guys do when you have artist block and if you draw like what do you do to kind of get out of that phase? Um, yeah, I've been pretty busy so i've been pretty tired and so for the most of the weekend i've been sleeping a lot rather than doing artwork and stuff so um this is the reason why i had to draw plushies because honestly i'm just in this weird mood where i'm just tired the whole time i got up pretty late like i normally get up when my alarm clocks like um goes off and normally it's set for like 6 a.m on regular days even if i don't work it's set 6 a.m and literally i woke up to turn off my alarm and then i went back to sleep because i have nothing 
really important to do and then after that I was like I need to get up and draw something so I decided to do this I added some shading on the bear so that he so that way it looks kind of like realistic for like the layers like the head is above like the arms and the legs are underneath right um yeah these are really simple to do but I think they're super cute and they they show a lot about my personality, like what I like to collect and stuff. Super cuddly and soft things are always nice to have around. Um, sometimes I get stressed out a lot, and so this is just something that helps me de-stress. I love that, like, instead of... It's kind of my way of getting out of, like I said, like, artist block. So it's better than just sitting around and being like, I don't know what to draw and stuff like that. Um, it's easier to find inspiration in my room because I collect so many plushies. So I use them as inspiration more than half of the time. So yeah. I really need to get into watching maybe some new animes though because recently all I've been drawing is like Genshin characters. So yeah, and... I've just been watching the new My Hero Academia, like, episodes, and that's basically it. Um, so if you guys have any, like, animes that you like, let me know in the comment section below, like, if there's any new good ones. There was one that I was interested in, but I'm not too sure. It's called Buddy Daddies. It's about, like, spies. Kind of like spies, but they're more like hitmen, and they go and, like do their jobs and then they end up taking in this little girl and it kind of gets annoying <laughs> um but it looks super cute and i don't know if funimation has it so i'll double check but that's the only anime that i know that i wanted to watch and now i'm outlining the bear i know i didn't make him super fuzzy like the material of the bear is supposed to be fuzzy but i tried to make it as simple as possible so that way it looks cutesy so yeah so hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like subscribe and share check down in the description box below all my social medias there i'll be posting all the process work for this guy as well i took pictures of him so yeah and that's basically it and then my next drawing will definitely be the koala bear that i have and that one i purchased for my kirishima so, I thought it would be cute to get, like, Kirishima and Bakugo, like, matching stuff. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye!